testing. I intend to utilize that for fuel, that much fuel. Uh, I'm not really going to cook anything this time. Um, just want to see how the flame burns. And uh, I might not even use half that much fuel, but in any case, we're going to see what the if the water works or not. Okay, so I made the mistake of putting the water in the bottle first, so the water went into the coil, and then as soon as it started to get hot, it just spewed up the water and got everything wet inside. So, bottom line is don't put the water in until it's nice and hot. Then let the water go through, put the water in and let it go through the tubes. Uh, because, yeah, it just, uh, just completely wets everything. It has to be up to temperature first, and I should have known better. But anyway, you try things out, you'll learn as you go. So anyway, now i got to like dry everything out and try to get it burning and get the, the remaining water out of the coil. See, I still, I think I'm going to have to dump out the coil water because it's still not coming all the way out. And then it just, when it heats up, it just spews out like a volcano, which is exactly what I want it to do, but but only when it's hot enough to create steam and not water. There might, you'll still, once it gets burned down a little bit more, it'll probably get more, more steam or water out. Let's see. The wood that I'm using is not very good wood either. see that <laughs> and I have the water turned off but there's a lot of water still in the copper coil that needs to come out and that's, that's what's been putting the fire out so yeah definitely don't put the water in until it's nice and it's going good then let the water go through It's, it's, there's still a lot of water down on the bottom of the coil. See that? It's just spewing out the water. I need to, I need to dump it. Okay, now it seems to be going pretty good. Um, now I'm gonna take out the tripod, I think, right now. See, uh, see what I can do here. Um, I haven't turned the water on yet. I'm just waiting for it to get up to temperature. Uh, it should be pretty good right now. Oh, a little steam left, or yeah, a little water left in the coil. Okay, so now let's see what happens if we if we uh, turn it. Okay, there we go. I'll put it up. Hmm. Doesn't seem like any water's going through. Huh. 
Okay, well, the rocket stove part of it seems to be working really good. You know, I just moved the pieces of twigs a little bit more as the fuel goes, and it uh, it's burning really nicely. I would put uh, skewers through here and then put a pot on, with a little bit of a sleeve to keep the heat in. So the rocket stove part is, is doing really good. And we could just move those in a little bit. I have to get some more twigs. Um, but the water is not siphoning as nicely as I thought it would. It's slowly siphoning, but not very fast. So um, I'm going to have to work on that. Okay, now the bad boy's going. I just had to lift up the, uh, the uh, water to get a little more pressure in, and then it, then it went. It was just let a little bit of steam through. Or actually, water. actually not heating up the water as much as I thought it would to superheat the steam. Let's see. Just open this up a little bit. Just a little bit.